Grew up in a small town in Western PA A quiet kid with a lot to say But Bobby was just a boy back then Smoking cigarettes and hanging out with his friend When he met Lainey she was trying to bend You? Mary, it's me, Victor. That's impossible. Victor's been dead for 10 years. Leave before I call the police. How is this possible? Everybody thought you were dead. Can I come in? I'll explain everything. Yes, please come in. So have a seat. I'm at a loss for words. It's been almost 10 years. I attended the funeral. Everyone thought you were dead. I'm sorry, Mary. I really am. I'm going to do the best I can to try to explain this to you. But I'm not going to lie. It's, it's going to be really hard to understand. Well, at this point, I pretty much believe almost anything. Can I offer you a drink or something? <laughs> no, thank you. I've definitely had my fill. Okay, so 10 years ago, I was on a routine mission in Afghanistan. My unit was attacked, but not by people. I mean, they were light people, but they were something else. Something that I just couldn't believe. Something that nightmares are made of. <laughs> and you expect me to believe this? Please, Mary, just hear me out. My entire unit was killed. I was the only survivor. I mean, if you can call it really surviving. Well, you look pretty alive to me, honey. I woke up under the jeep. I had bite marks on me. They were more animal-like than human. As I went to get out of the jeep, my hand, as soon as that sunlight hit, it was like fire. That burn could be from anything. I think you've lost your mind. I think it'd be best if you just leave. Please, Mary, let me explain. I'm here to explain all this to you before I tell you goodbye. Why did you come here, Victor? With this crazy story, you've been gone for 10 years and you show up in the middle of the night? Haven't seen a sunrise in 10 years. Don't you have a photo of me, Mary? Have I even aged in 10 years? What about the strap mole I took in my eye? This is insane. I have done horrible things to survive, Mary. Drinking human blood is what's kept me alive. You're a vampire. This is impossible. They don't exist. Oh, but they do. But not the mist you see on movies. The crosses don't mean nothing. We are actually fond of garlic. We don't have fangs, but the sunlight myth, that, that remains true. Don't be afraid. I would never hurt you. I just came here to apologize for leaving you all these years and to end this nightmare. I will always love you. Thank you.